Way to earn pocket money, Denise. Mike, the news here. Come in. Hello. Yes. I tried. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry, Elaine. We'll help you for a small fee. Me, you okay? Thank you. Yeah, sure. Oh, dear. All right. Hi, Elena. I'm Alice. You two will be sharing a room. Oh, good. My crystal says you're really nice. I am going to like it here. I can feel really positive vibes. <laughs> What's up, Marco? Someone at your spaceship. It's Mother's Day tomorrow. I know, but at least you've got her say. Thanks, but I need a mum. Me too. No, I really need a mum. A Mother's Day special. A free potted plant for every mum who visits our shop. You want a potted plant? And a free inflatable alien for any child with her. I've wanted an alien for ages. Can't Mrs Boxer take you? No, she's in Scotland looking for the Loch Ness Monster. This person just have to forget it. Mums don't exactly grow on trees around here. So, what did you think of Elaine? My crystal says she's really nice. Really? We all think he's a pain. Maybe it just needs polishing. Guess what? I've got a really wobbly tooth. Do you think my tooth fairy will find me now I've moved? Don't worry. Mike always gives us a pound. That's really nice of him, but I'm not sure Willow Heather would like that. <laughs> Biscuit? Oh, lovely. Um, what have I forgotten? Oh, my, I've lost a new girl! Chill out, Elaine, she's with Mike. You really need help, Elaine. I know. Everything just seems to be getting on top of me lately. I just don't seem to be able to cope anymore. I'm on a roller coaster of mayhem and disaster. Even simple things seem to go better. Elaine, perfect. and get a grip and sort your life out before you completely crack up! to the old Elaine and hello to the new... Where's my coat? Good morning. Marco, wake up. Ah! Don't panic. Yes, us. Happy Mother's Day. Today is your lucky day. Which mum do you want? Don't choose him. He's got a big bum. But at least I haven't got hair and legs. Choose me and get a lifetime supply of chocolate cakes. It's up to you, Marco Maloney. Pick your mum and get your alien. Can't even remember what my mum looks like. Come on, Marco. We're better than nothing. OK. You're too small. Your clothes are horrible. You're too scary. It'll have to be you, even though you need a shave. Oh, yes! Yes! <laughs> well, he didn't choose you lot, did he? This mirror 
all balance out the yin and the yang. Oh, is that good? Very. Now let's put the tooth in. <laughs> oh no, don't put it there. It's really bad feng shui. Can we put it right in the middle? So the energy flows smoothly around it. I want everything to be perfect for Hello Heather. Oi, new girl. Hi, I'm Alice. What's that pile of junk? Um, a fairy palace. Oh, great. Another weirdo. Pardon? Only babies believe in rubbish like that. Don't be so mean, Roxy. Ooh, I'm scared. Don't set the fairies on me. They might bite my kneecaps. Don't worry about her. She's all right. She seems quite nice, really. Maybe she just needs her aura cleansed. <laughs> It's sorted. Goodbye. Is that Elaine? No. It can't be. Good morning, everyone. Elaine. The new improved Elaine. But you look fantastic. Well, thank you. After speaking to Justine, I decided to see a life coach, which I'm sure you'll agree will benefit us all. Now, as it's Mother's Day, inevitably a difficult day for children in care, I've prepared a few treats. Enjoy. <gasps> My favourite. Mine too. Hey, Alice, no fairy cakes. Nice one, Justine. Thanks. I'm a miracle worker. I've totally transformed the woman. It'll end in tears. I don't know if this is such a good idea. I mean, I just don't feel really very mumsy. But Bouncy, you promised. <sighs> OK. But you've not got to stay outside. And no peeping. Mum's the word. Mum? <laughs> and no taking the mickey. Now, listen carefully, everyone. I have some important changes to announce. Firstly, I shall be introducing compulsory fitness sessions. Cool. Compulsory? In your dreams. A healthy body makes a healthy mind, Roxy. Well, she'll have to catch me first. Thank you. And secondly, I shall be inspecting your bedrooms later on this afternoon. Cluttered, untidy rooms reflect cluttered, untidy lives. Unfortunately, pocket money will have to be withheld until the right attitude is attained. Thank you. Hey, Arthur. Can I have an alien, please? Oh, not you again. Look, I told you yesterday, this is a Mother's Day promotion, and for that, believe it or not, you need to bring your mother. But I have. Well, oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> How about a nice romantic dinner, sweetheart? Uh, I'm on a diet. I know a place where they do wonderful salads. I'm uh, allergic to lettuce. Uh, one leaf and I go all puffy, like a big puffy puffball. It's not a pretty sight, really. And then there's a 50% chance of me exploding. <laughs> oh, oh, you're funny, too. I like that in a woman. Well, you wouldn't like my little monkeys. They come with me wherever I go. <laughs> Mummy, we're hungry. Can we have some crisps? Please, Mummy. No! What lovely children! Go on, give us your number. Oh, come on, children. We really must be leaving now. Don't be shy. I think you're a lovely lady. Oi, get off. I mean, uh, oi, get off. You're not a woman. Right, come on, I haven't got time for these silly games. Out of my shop. Wait. Please don't be angry. He's only dressed up because I haven't got a mum. What do you mean? We live in a care home. Oh, I see. 
Well, you should have just told me in the first place. What? I still have the alien. Ugh, go on, then. Thanks. We don't have mums either. <laughs> Neither do I. Uh, I'll have a pot of plant though, sort of same. Thanks, sweetheart. <laughs> recycle rubbish, recycle don't need. This is so empowering, isn't it, Alice? Um, yes. Clearing out all this unnecessary baggage. You're the only unnecessary baggage around here. <laughs> yeah, you're rubbish. How extremely immature. You don't mind me inspecting your room first, do you, Alice? Uh, no. Whoa. This is well spooky. Where is everything? And everyone. I think I might know where they've gone. Take me to your leader, my gun. Oh, what have I done now? The new rain threw away Alice's fairy palace. Look, I, I don't want any faults. It's OK. Here, look, I, I managed to say my tooth. I know. I've created a monster. look better, more efficient and smoother running. It's called streamlining. No, it isn't. It's called messing with other people's dreams. This is Alice's fairy palace and you threw it out while you were cleaning out the clutter. The older lane might have been a total muppet, but she'd never do something like that. There you go, Alice. Thanks, Lang. Thanks, Justine. It's good as new. Oh dear. Don't worry, I'll do that. Um, shall I be, Mum? Would you like a cup of tea, Lang? Yes, please. Bounce, you can stop now, please. <laughs> Get it. Lang. Lang. Sorry. Yeah. 